Well guys, it's 2018 and I don't know about you guys, but I'm so ready to live my best life. And one of the things that I'm starting off with is eating healthy. And so Christine, let's talk about eating healthy. Yes, because the thing to remember here is almost every diet is medically or scientifically a successful pathway to lose weight, but is that your path? And I think being able to authentically align with what works for you is the key to our success in 2018, which means eating foods that honor your body and that actually feel good to your body. Eating a lot of junk food may feel good in a temporary moment, but if we're thinking about our future self, more realistically, it doesn't feel that great. You are so right, and you just reminded me of my younger days when I knew nothing about eating healthy, and I was eating fast food and processed foods all the time, and I wasn't paying attention to my body. And your body really tells you if it likes what you're feeding it or not. And so, for example, I'd get you know burgers, fries, Coke, and after I'd eat, I'd feel so bloated and icky and I'd have indigestion. And I just thought that that was like the norm. You know, I thought, hey, that's just what happens, you know, after you eat food, you're supposed to feel like that, but you, you aren't. And so that's your body saying you're putting bad stuff, you know, into me and treat me like a temple and feed me nutrients and not just empty calories. That's right, exactly, honor it. It's funny, growing up Italian, um, we would always eat pasta. But I never really liked pasta and they, people would tease me, what kind of Italian are you? But I would get this bloated feeling and only till I really started tuning into my body that I realized I'm not gluten allergic, but I'm gluten intolerant and it doesn't feel good. So guess what's off my list? Pasta. <laughs> <laughs> well, no, and you're right. And it's like when you change your diet and you start feeding your body with nutritious things, your body starts feeling better and it's running better and you start having more energy you can think clearer like yes. that brain fog start you know starts going away you sleep better and it's your body saying i really appreciate what you're putting into me now yeah. and and it, it makes a difference yeah and if you're having a hard time get it, getting started eating healthier a really great tip is to just add a fruit or vegetable with every meal that you have which means if you're even having a pizza, add a plate of broccoli. Because the truth is, just by this little simple strategy, you can significantly reduce the damage of unhealthier eating. And that's important for us right now when we're getting started. Absolutely, and one of the things that the body really reacts well to and runs so much better on is a lot of water. Yes. And so drinking you know, the eight glasses of water, and especially lemon water is really yes. good for you. It really cleans the system out, you know, builds the immune system. You're gonna find yourself having less colds, less flus, having more energy, and even the skin looking younger and clearer also. Yes, and water is also a really helpful tip for losing weight. Yeah, that's right. Staying hydrated, it also helps keep you fuller longer. Yep. So all that to say, add lots of water to your yes. diet and veggies, veggies and protein. Colorful. Make your plate a rainbow. You can't go wrong. Plus, who doesn't want to eat a pretty plate? I Just love saying. It. <laughs>